Butterfly houses are not overly in the common in the Midwest. But in western Wisconsin, there is one place natural butterflies can fly free in a garden habitat. It's Beaver Creek Reserve's Butterfly House. We have thousands of native Wisconsin butterflies. We have caterpillars, chrysalises, eggs, host plants, nectaring plants. It's very rare for people to see this, especially in other local communities, because they don't have spaces like this where they can come see the butterflies that we have here in our state. So it's a pretty unique experience for people to get out and learn. There aren't many places you can get an up-close look at local butterflies in Wisconsin. That's why staff with the Beaver Creek Reserve say they think their butterfly house is growing in popularity. Typically, their butterfly house gets around 5,000 visitors a year, but this year was different with 2,000 visitors in the first two weeks. We're kind of a hidden gem out here in Fall Creek, Wisconsin, so having folks come out from all areas, whether they're from Wisconsin, other parts of the United States, or even worldwide, I mean, we see people inter internationally come to visit our butterfly house because it's starting to get so much popularity. There's probably thousands and thousands of butterflies that are in here, and especially when we get towards the end of the season, I'm sure it, this whole place will be just full of them. Another reason for Beaver Creek Reserve's popularity is because they don't buy Buy their caterpillars from suppliers around the nation. So every butterfly in here is either caught by a staff member or a volunteer or we um, have raised it from egg or caterpillar to be an adult butterfly. We have tons of um, plants in here as well. By coming out to Beaver Creek, which is a very rural area, uh, they can see butterflies, they can see caterpillars, they can see plants, all super up close that they more, might not normally be able to see and observe while they are in town. The Beaver Creek Reserve will be releasing all the butterflies at the end of summer so they can migrate south. In Fall Creek, Ellie Albrecht, First News at 9.